We're here at the women's field hockey practice getting an inside look on Lily Nitskin and how she balances two collegiate sports, softball and field hockey. Playing a collegiate sport can be very time consuming, but Lily finds joy and expectation in participating in both softball and field hockey. In high school, I really didn't know which sport I wanted to play and I was kind of freaking out like, oh my God, I have to make a decision. And um, once I came here, and talked to both coaches and they kind of talked with each other and said it was okay. It was kind of the best of both worlds, so I couldn't really pass it up. Uh, in Lily's case, you know, I know she's going to be gone for the spring and, you know, that was part of her deal when, we, when she came here. You know, and I knew, I've known this for, you know, two or three years, so it's not anything I had to get used to. You know, it was, I knew she wasn't going to be here and Renee, the softball coach, knew she wasn't going to be there in the fall. Balancing softball, field hockey, and academics can sound pretty overwhelming, but it sounds like Lily has it all figured out. We wonder, just how does she do it? What do other people think about it? Lily's work ethic is pretty amazing. I mean, I don't know how she does it, honestly. I've been doing this, I've been playing field hockey with her since high school, um, and she's been playing softball and field hockey the whole time, and honestly, I don't know how she does it. Keeping up with academics while participating in a collegiate sport is very important. Lily has grasped that fact and knows just how hard she has to work. During field hockey season, I can only do field hockey, so I can only go and watch softball. Um, so that's kind of one thing where I, I don't have to practice all both sports at once, but also just like getting like my work done ahead of time because like having to go from classes to practice and then we travel all the time. So just getting everything done ahead and not procrastinating is pretty much the biggest thing. She's a hard worker. I mean, she has to be, you know, because when she has to make up for the time that she missed at field hockey, she's having to make up for the time she missed for softball. And I think it's probably a little harder on the softball end, you know, because the timing, you know, hitting a softball is a lot harder than hitting a field hockey ball. So I think it really hurts her more uh, missing the softball practice time than the field hockey time. Lily is expected to have a great season for softball and field hockey. We wish her the best of luck. This is Kenesha Johnson signing off for Bellarmine Sports.